We finally made it, boys. Today's episode is sponsored, thankfully, by Raid Shadow Legend. Fuck off, is it? Fuck right off, is it? No, it's not. But, little funny story. Did get an email from the developers of Raid Shadow Legends offering me £300 to do a 45-second advertisement for their terribly shit money-grabbing game. Um, as you can probably tell from the tone, I said no. I did tweet about it, and lot and and you guys are amazing. Every literally everybody was like, "Just do it, man. We all know it's fine. It's you know it's cool. Just just take the money. You know you need the money and all that sort of stuff." But no, no. I've I've watched a video about it, the the, the game and stuff like that of what it is, and it's it's just one of those freebie games that has a million microtransactions that if you want something to look prettier or stronger or build faster, you have to pay the money and stuff. And I know 99% of you will just go, oh, cool. You know, I'm not going to play it, but I'm glad Loki's getting some sponsorship and stuff. Um, but I, in case there's one, because you get a script, you literally have to read from a script. So I have to tell you how good it is and stuff, which would be a lie because it's a shit game. Um, but also... They don't rely, those companies don't rely on on guys like you and me that might pick up a mobile game, might play it for 20 hours, might chuck a fiver in just to get going or whatever. They rely on whales, people that spend a shit ton of money. And if there's a chance that one person from my, my ad spot then goes and spends hundreds of pounds on this game and gets into it and addicted to it and stuff, then it's just, it's just not worth it. I'm just not going to do that. I have some pride in my work and stuff. And as much as I need the money... Um, it's just, it's just not something I'm willing to do. I've, I probably get one email a week, say asking me to sponsor something on my video. And as you see, I've done one sponsorship, sponsorship ever, which was called a game sellout for the company game, and that was only because it was clear what it was and stuff, and it was a bit of fun. But I'm not going to take random shit just to get a few quid because, like I said, if it influences one person to go and spend a load of money, then that's just not worth my time. But I do need cash. So today is a Patreon update. <laughs> I've got, uh, to be fair, it's about time I did one of these. <coughs> Excuse me, I've still got a fucking cough. It's not going away. Got another few days, I reckon. Snots and coughs. At least it's not coming out the other end in any velocity, which is good. Right, Mr. E Pig himself has upped his pledge. Harry Owens, mistress, welcome to Patreon. Jack Peach, thank you very much. Wong, oh, God, God, God. Wonji Bietsu has upped his pledge. Naked Blue Man, Peck and Wanley, Patrick Burden, T007 Disney has upped his pledge massively, like a huge. Thank you, mate. Uh, Brandon Ong, Robert, Robin Smith, Georgina O'Donnell. Nobody panic, but that's a woman's name. Nobody panic. Nobody panic. It's a woman's name. What's that? What's going on? What's going on? Um, <coughs> I made myself go. <coughs> Mark Dowding, Squigs, Ariane and John Parsons, thank you very much for joining Patreon. If you want to support me, what I do, so I don't have to take stupid, shitty, money-grabbing, grindy, wanky mobile game sponsorships, you can check out my Patreon in the link below. Yeah, I thought I'd tell you. I thought, should I tell them how much it is? And I'm like, well, they just sent me, the first email they sent, they said how much they're going to pay me. And I've, I've signed nothing to say it's an NDA. So, yeah. They were going to pay me 300 quid for 45 seconds. It's not bad. But that 45 seconds would have to be me lying out my ass for 45 seconds. And that's not what we do. Right. Transfers. Done some business, boys. <music> Greetings and salutations, my friends. Welcome back to the journeyman also just let you know update I'll, I'll update you on twitch and I'll, I'll make sure i mention it in a journeyman video when i'm gonna go streaming again I, I can't speak for too long without coughing my guts up so as soon as i'm better we'll be back to streaming right um <coughs> so some some bad news we've had the champions league draw we're playing them today you might have already seen it at the top there <sighs> playing red star champions league winners red star um they're they're, they're all right at the old fat balls, but we've made transfers. I'm really pleased with the business we've done, actually. Um, some really good freebies, like amazingly good freebies. Well, let's look at the outs first. So uh, a few, lots of the youngsters went. They weren't going to make it. I decided to get rid of Donitz. Um, we got our money back. We um, 2.1 million going up to 2.7. So he paid for himself, but he was 
for the, he was my first big signing, and he's he's just not worked out. He's I think if it wasn't for the injuries, I think he would have been more consistent and done better. But too many injuries, whether that's unlucky or just that he's got jelly legs, I don't know. But uh, he he just annoyed me more than anything. So we got the two point one million back for him. Um, we've loaned a few players out and all that sort of good stuff. Um, who's on the released player? Oh, no, released players. Um, Grubbs. Grubbs is the only sort of major player, the right back. Um, we'd always kind of outgrown him, to be honest. He's been with us a long time. You know, and he played all right last season, but we're outgrowing him now and we've we've made a replacement. <coughs> mm -mm -mm. Right, let's see who we bought in though, boys. Who we bought in. I'm very happy. We've spent not a great deal of money, only one signing. Um, but first off, we've got Ivan Hranjet from Lokomotiva. He was the free transfer that we got, our new Ungonch. We got, like, months ago, 19 years old, 21 under 21 caps. A lot of the big teams were in for him, so we were, like, snapped him up. Like, we're paying him a decent amount of money. But look, he's a freebie. He's five-star potential Played regularly last season for a decent side. So I'm very, very happy to pick him up. Next up, we have Alan Omarovic from Hadrick Split. Another Bosnian. We've got two Bosnian right-backs now. So an like, outstanding player for a freebie. He's on 4K. The wages are edging up a little bit, but that's okay. Um, just a really, really solid all-rounder. Really good physically. Only 23, so it can still improve a little bit as well. So the right-backs, we've got two great Bosnian right-backs now. Next up, we have Benjamin Mionic from Istra. Another free transfer, we have um, <coughs> loaned him out. We It's one of those weird ones. His contract was running out, and there was, a, again, a lot of big teams in for him. He's only 18 years old, um, including, like, Arsenal, Napoli, Juventus. I was like, gobble, gobble, gobble. But he wanted to sign a – fair play to him – wanted to sign a contract, but on the understanding that I would loan him back out the first season. So I thought, you know, fair enough. We've got another player in anyway. So uh, we've loaned him out to Locomoti Locomotiva, so he kind of replaces Hranjet for them. So it'd be interesting to see how he gets off in the, in, on in the top league, but uh, 18 years old, crack, cracking signing. Next up, we have Kronoslav Kenic. What are you looking at? What are you, looking, what are you thinking? What are you thinking? Of course, it's been a while, boys, but I'm making this central midfielder a left-back. <laughs> because I can, and because left-backs are just rare as rocking horse shit. A uh, really, really good, solid round, all-round player. Another 18-year-old. Uh, absolute bargains, boys. Um, paid a bit of money for him, but like I said, left-back's just a massive struggle. And so I was lo looking at him. Although he's not the most attacking left-back in the world, six crossing, eight dribbling, everything else he's pretty much got. So we're making him a left-back. Might take a little bit, but he's only 18, so he should develop nice and quick. Four-and-a-half-star potential. And finally, the brother of Miley Byrus. We've got Lovro Byrus. Um... Before the comments start, no, I'm not going to rename him Coronavirus, okay? <laughs> I did consider it, but I thought, you know, people have died. So maybe it's in a little bit of bad taste. He is our new right winger on loan from Lazio. He's on a big chunk of, he's, I think he's now our highest paid player. But, you know, I'm, he's not the brother of Virus, Miley Virus, but we're just going to pretend he is. It's just bugged there, right? It's, it, there's, there's, he's, he's the brother, okay? Where did he... Oh, so he was another Dynamo Zagreb. They picked him up for 2.7 million and he's not made it. Um, okay, so I'm pretty happy. We've done bits. We've done... I'm really, really pleased now. We've got most of the positions. We've got a couple of good players for. I'm very excited to see how we get on. We've got one of our youngsters that's really progressing quite nicely. Um, Simic, who's 19 years old, come, come through the ranks and is developing lovely. So he's going to be a backup playmaker. We've got, um, obviously, the two Croatian left-backs now. We've got two Bos Bosnian right-backs. Goalkeeper's the only thing. <sighs> Do I play him? Do I play goal in goal? He's starting to... <sighs> no. He was goalkeeper of the year last year, right? More so to do with our defence than the, the goalkeeper. But, no, we'll go with experience. So, Miley Byrus up top. KP, just back from international duties. I've turned down £8 million for KP. There was, there was a few teams. I think it's only Torpedo now that won him, but there was a few teams. Um, finances looking good. £10 million quid in the in the old bankage. Training facilities, youth facilities, both being completed in November. 
<coughs> Excuse me. So what we talked about last episode, right, is that the, the job we wanted, which is this one, Obviously, I want to carry on here for the next maybe year or two. I really want to overtake um, Dynamo Kiev. Dynamo Kiev? Um, yeah, Chicken Kiev. Um, Dynamo Zagreb, which in and of itself is quite tricky because I was looking at their player. Like, they've got one player on 57 grand a week. Our entire, bud our entire spending is 70 grand. <laughs> so there's a little bit of a gap, but we're going to try our best. But I think because we're going, we want this job, because we want to overtake Portugal and take it. So this this here, we have to keep an eye on it. Because if it becomes available, it's not going to become available very often. If it becomes available, then I think we just have to go for it at any point. So it could happen any day, which is a little bit annoying. But okay. Right. Are we ready to go? <sighs> Jesus, this is going to be terrible, isn't it? Okay, Champions League, boys. Champions League. It's the away leg first. Oh, God. Oh, God. I don't like it. <clears throat> it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. You know I'm nervous when I do the extra team talk. We d oh, we, we played one league game of the season. We lost 1-0. Uh, we lost 2-1. We scored from a corner. They scored two from corners. And that, that was how it ended. So we haven't started the season well. So good times. Right. What do we want from this game? Do we... A score draw, I guess, would be ideal. Just, I want us to be at least in it, the second leg. So we've got a chance. They've taken the piss a bit, haven't they? Yes, Rosic! Come on, good save. Oh, I'm nervous. Come on. They want us to reach the third qualifying round, which is next round as well. Come on, we just need to get a bit lucky, I'm assuming. I'm so nervous. I want us to I want us to have a little play in Europe. We we got we barely touched it last season. And I haven't looked at the rules of if we qualify for Europa League or what. Depending on what round of the qualifiers we get, I'm just gonna just see what happens. Hranjet, nice. Ibrahimovic, that's it. Go on, go on, beat him. Lovely. KP, floated header. Take it as a shot. Okay, that's not too bad. Thirty minutes gone. Keep it tight, lads. <clears throat> Oh, Rosic! It was the right decision. The experience. Okay, they've had a couple of clear cut chances, but it's coming to half time and we're nil nil. Oh no, here we go. Rosic lumps one forward. Okay, we've got it. Morrow, early ball. Can we pick up the scraps? <laughs> Fucking hell, he just absolutely murdered him. O'Connor. O'Connor, easy, easy for Rosic. Didn't like the way he just flew past our midfield. Okay, this is good. I'm pleased. I'm bloody delighted, lads. Love Road Byrus is a little bit knackered. We've been perks on for the last half an hour or so. We haven't created much, to be fair, but we're doing all right. Ugh. Just jumping into the tackles too easy, making it too easy. Bur Burbovic. Away! Away! Go on, get there. Oh, we're just not getting to anything. Come on. Oh, I've got a bad feeling. Get get there, get there, get there, get there. Get there. Stop it! Stop it! That's a good header away. We're just winning none of the second balls, though. It just keeps coming back. Sorensen, back post. Oh, my Jesus. Okay. Perks. Um. Okay. 
hanging on a little bit now, lads. Hanging on a little. There's a lot. There's more highlights coming. I don't like it. I'm even tempted to change the tactic. Oh, it's fine. It's fine, isn't it? Okay, cause an injury. Excellent, excellent. Fuck them up, boys. Fuck them up. I'm going to praise them. Oh, I've overwhelmed him with my praise. I said praise him, not give him a hand job. Oh, hang on. Hang on. KP, come on. Can we nick it? Satulo. Fucking Satulo. He scored in the league game as well. He's two for two, the centre back. Oh, we got him on loan for another season. Probably should have mentioned that earlier. Third season in a row, we've got him in on loan. And he's gone and scored a goal. He's gone and scored a fucking goal, lads. Like, wait. Wait. Um, the joys of having this guy, that, that Kerich guy that we're going to retrain as a left back, is he can also play as a DM. Let's just make you... I'll keep you on support, but just simplify your drop role a little bit. Just drop you boys back to supports. Don't want to go too crazy. Still got plenty of time left. Let's notch one back. And we'll have some time wastage, please. Got an away goal. I don't even know if they count, but we've got one. That's being Bobby. Bit of pace up top for the counter-attack goal. Come on, boys. Is it corner? Come on. Oh, it's a free header. Marco Kurtizic. That's fine. That's fine. One all is great. I called it. That was just too easy. I'm, oh, I'm cock watching. This is so bad. Five minutes. Three minutes. One minute. Yes, yes boys. We'll take that all day long. All day long. One all draw away from home. All right, then. <coughs> the late goal was a punch in the dick, but that's fine. Right, we're going to skip the Ozajek game and then we'll be back for the second leg. Ooh. Like, nobody panic, but we, 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 we've lost again in the league. We lost 1 0. Um, and uh, Satula got injured, our top goal scorer this season. Um, got in our only goal scorer this season? <laughs> our only goal scorer this season um, is now injured. So, yeah, that's, that's good, isn't it? Um, okay. We played all right. It was, a, it was a pretty even game, um, but they had a penalty. It could have been two guys actually fouled him in the, in the same incident, but that's fine. No no need to panic. We had a good result against them. Karaoke Doki, my child is coming in to lead the back line. Um, I'm going to... Libra's done nothing. Oh, Omarovic is coming in. I'm just going to call him Alan. It's a lot easier. All right. Even if he spells his name wrong, that's fine. Oh, no, lads, come on. It's classic, you know, European football is, is, is diverted our attentions away from the league form. It's not good. It's not good, lads. Um, Perkovic is going to start, get his first start of the season. Milo Baris is going to play. KP is going to play. They're, they're fine. It's fine. It's fine. Okay. We can do this, boys. We can do this. There's no need to panic. I am panicking a little bit. Home game. Okay. I'm going to stay positive. Hopefully, create a couple more chances. This, this, is, this is as good a chance as we're going to get here, boys. Come on, Alan. Leonard. Come on, Alan. Be good. Leonard, the playmaker, floats the ball in. KP with a header wide. It's weird that the advanced playmaker attack seems to be, wins a lot of, or has to be head of the ball a lot. So he's sort of a target man playmaker. It's different. He seems to find himself in that position quite regularly. Winners. Okay, we've got men back though. Jukopovic. Switches the play, headed on. Good header away. KP nods it down. Hranjek. 
into Hasek, the ball winning midfielder on a yellow card. Not ideal. KP's got out wide if needed. Oh, KP, come on, man. <coughs> oh, I thought that was my child that missed the header, but it's all right. It wasn't. We're good. O'Connor. He was decent last game. Cover it, cover it, cover it, cover it. No, you're not going to score from a header from there, mate. Okay, 20 minutes in. I feel like we're going to need to score. Because I think they're... Oh, good tackle, Alan. Get there. Go on, chase it. It's unlucky. Got men back. Jacko with a good header. KP. Lays it off to Morrow. And there he goes. Oh. Uh, Spazojevic gets the goal. What happened here? Is it Morrow just... Oh, Morrow, what is that? What is that? Dude. Okay, it's all right. It's all right. Still early doors. No winners. Good header. Karaoke doki with a header. Leonard. Come on. Need a peach of a pass. That'll do. Hasek. Gets it to KP. Loves it to cut inside. Tries to force it a little bit, feels. O'Connor comes away with it. Oh, shit. Nenandovic. Get there. Oh, he's on the yellow card. Force the tackle out of him. Stefanovic. O'Connor. Plays it out. Oh. Kurtzovic. Get him, get him, get him, Alan. Oh, it's not good, lads. It's not good. It's not good. Corner ball. Another yellow card for them, though. That might be our only hope at this point. Jacko gets a good header away. Leonard. Here we go. Counter attack. We've got runners. It's two on two. Oh, what a turn. What Miley Byrus. Oh, short sure score. It's such a good turn. Oh, that was the moment, man. Oh, that was so good as well. <coughs> Keeper, wanna stick out a hand just in case. Right. They're frustrated. We're fired up. Okay, Perkovic is dead. Okay, sorry, it's not sending off. It's not sending off. Could have been worse. Could have been worse. Oh. Oh my god, I just bought him on. Just this second. <sighs> the game hates me. Is this season just going to fall apart? I've got a bad feeling about this season, lads. I've got a very bad feeling. Yes, Jacko, good header. Out wide, out wide. No, not there. The corner picks it up again. I get it half time, lads. Get it half time. We could play Bobby up top and then move Miley Byrus out on the right wing. I guess that's what we have to do next. Come on, let's make a tackle. Stick in a foot. Okay, st stand. <laughs> it's not looking good. <laughs> Apparently, we're the only team with a clear-cut chance, but that's optimistic. I'll go. I need to fire him up. Okay, so Bobby, swap you two round. That's two of our subs used. Come on. Oh dear, lads. I'm not confident. I am not remotely confident. They're winning every header as well. This, this could be our Haranjek. Dinks it. Karaoke. Oh, Karaoke was there. He was there. Oh, this is dangerous. Does anybody want to try and make a tackle? Yes, Hasik. They've got, they've got lucky with it. Oh, that's a deflection. Oh, unlucky. So lucky. So lucky. 
made a good tackle, and then the pass was deflected, and it just rolled into his path three yards out. That's a great tackle. And then this takes a big deflection and just falls into his path. And it's, well, let's hope away goals don't matter, but I'm not sure it's going to make any difference. Okay. Sort you two round, make you a potcher. Chuck you out on the right wing. It'll be fine, Hendrik. All right. Could go Ibra. Okay. <laughs> um, let's do it. Let's do it. All the buttons. All the buttons. <coughs> Excuse me. Stefanovic. Jesus. We can't actually win headers. Come on, win a header. Win a header. Win a header. Win a header. What's happened? Why can't we win any headers? Okay, good. Right, it's over. It's over. Come on, show a bit of pride, lads. Come on, get a goal. Win a tackle or a header before the end of the match. That's the new new test. That's a good ball out, though. Morrow, all the time in the world. Decent ball. That's unlucky. That showed a bit of spirit. Oh, God, that's not even the highlight. Stefanovic into Nanadovic. They love a bitch. Stefanovic. <coughs> You're taking a piss now, lads. That's offside, surely. It's not, it's not even offside. It's, he just ripped apart the offside trap. Look at all the yellow cards. Are we out of Europe now? Do we go into the Europa League qualifiers? I have all the Euro 2 Cup. I have no clue. A winner header. It's a difficult skill to head balls, apparently, lads. Whilst it's just played at 5.9. Hang on, the window's still open. I need to buy a goalkeeper. Just buy a goalkeeper. Even if it doesn't... On paper, it's not an upgrade. I think I just need a different goalkeeper. Come on, get there. Yes. Yes, Bobby. Check. Go on, Bobby. Battle for it. What a legend. Ball in. Hit it, Hasik. Oh, for fuck's sake. 4 nil. <sighs> Nearly all from headers. And one bit of luck. I just end it. End it. Another fucking header. What's happened to our heading? Okay, lads. Let's see what. <clears throat> let's just move on. Let's just let's just move on. Okay. <sighs> Four weeks. Couple of days. Oh, we got a bit of cash. Yay. Oh, we were only fairly competitive. Okay, Europa League. Just fair nord then. Best place third qualifying round. Goal drought. More cash. Fixture rearranged. When is it? It's probably very, very soon, isn't it? All right, then. Just Feyenoord then, lads. Just easy, easy Feyenoord. That's, what they, that's their nickname, isn't it? Easy Feyenoord. <sighs> Fuck. It's not good. It's not good, though, is it? They're still quite a good team. All right, then. Well, this has not been an ideal start to the season, let's call it. We'll be back for Feyenoord games, if we're not sacked before then. Because we've got two league games as well, so that's you never know what's going to happen. It's all falling apart, boys. Let's just keep an eye on... Is it because I tempted fate by talking about the sporting job? And we're like, we'll keep an eye on it. Oh, dear. Right, there we go, my friends. Thank you very much to the new patrons. You are all superstars and the people that have their pleasure. And if you want to support me, what I do here, then the link is in the description. Thank you very much. Don't forget, don't download Raid Shadow Legends. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.